Troubleshooting is much easier when you can have access to your computer error codes and see how to resolve them. This is why Adobe created the Adobe Log Collector Tool. In this video, I will show you how you can install this tool, how you can find error codes, and then use those error codes to find solutions quickly. First, you will need to download the Adobe Log Collector Tool. You can do that by searching in your browser or via the resources on this page. This will take you to a page where you can download the Log Collector Tool for your system. My system is a Windows system, but the steps I will walk you through are similar for Mac. Once you extract and install the Log Collector Tool and give it the access it needs, you will be asked if you would like to launch the tool. I'll click Yes, and this brings us to a window explaining what the tool will do, where it will put the logs, and the permissions it requires. If everything checks out, we just need to hit Continue, and then click Continue again to allow it to collect the logs from our machine. Pretty quickly, we have what we need. Now, we could send this file, in my case a .zxp, to Adobe for help, but let me show you how we can use the logs and find codes and diagnose them. All we need to do is go to the file location and extract or unzip it. Now we're ready to find error codes. For example, we can dive into the folder and then to user temp. I want to find the logs inside of the Creative Cloud user temp folder, so I'll click this and then the ACC folder. Here is where the PD app log is. If we click on that, it will open. We can search for error codes by typing in the word fatal. In this line, we can see that to the right of the word fatal is operation failed 8 and the error code 195. Let's see if there are any other codes by continuing to search for fatal. Yep, we have another error code 195. So we have seen this error in a few places. Let's see if there are any errors in the install logs. We'll just navigate back a few folders and click on the install log to search for the word fatal. We can see here that the system's requirement failed, and if we go into the line below, we see another fatal followed by error code 195. In this case, we can see that it looks like After Effects is the main issue here. This error code has shown up a few times, so let's figure out what it means. You can click on the resources on this page or search for Adobe installation error codes and then click on this link. Here, we can type in our error code number 195 and see a description and solution for our error. Hopefully this gives you an idea of how you can use the Adobe Log Collector tool for everyday troubleshooting. But if you ever have a complex problem or just need some help, please reach out to your Adobe representative and support team. Thanks for watching.